So what happened was I looked out my window and one day I noticed a bunch of bees flying around. So I looked outside and it was just so many. It must have been like 200 flying around. So I looked up on Craigslist, called a guy to uh, come take a look at it, maybe remove them because I didn't want to kill them. And uh, this is what happened. How do I look? Good? You look good. good. It's about a six or eight month old hive. They're all just sitting there. And they're pretty calm actually. There's, some, there's the smoke. They're trying to ignore me as much as possible. No, I'm detaching it from the ceiling and they don't like me handling the piece that I'm handling. It's very soft. I gotta vacuum this one. Wow, there's a lot on your head. I'm gonna vacuum you. This is a drone right here. The big fat one. They're trying to salvage whatever honey they can. That's capped honey. If you stuck your finger in there, you get nothing but honey out. Looking for the queen before I vacuum. What would you do if you found the queen? I'd vacuum her up. <laughs> because then I know I have her. Honey's always on top to insulate. And then these are the babies right here, the brown spots. And these bigger ones are drones. These are queen cells here. They make new queens. When the new queens are born, the old one will leave with half the hive. And it's their way of population control and creating new hives. Wow. Holy wow. Yeah, there it comes. If you look in there, there's larva. When the larva get big enough, they straighten out. And then they cap them, and that's when the larva turns into a bee. And it just takes seven days to do that. That's your only piece of honey. It has to be capped. It's called bees in the bag. I have to let them out. As soon as possible because they'll suffocate in there. So we'll take this out of here, put it outside so that they're in fresh air or else they'll die. It's so hot in there. Okay. I'm not just being a show off. I do need to take them out so that they don't overheat themselves. If I was going to kill them, I would have just sprayed them all. So exterminators have it easier. They didn't have to go through all that <laughs> to keep them alive. Oh wow. Feel how warm it is right there. Oh wow, it's so much heat. Inside their hive it's always 98 degrees. They can still stink through my glove. So I'm trying to pull them all out. Oh, wow. See now they could all breathe. There's where all your bees are. <laughs> 